Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video, and in today's episode we'll be playing some more Fallout 3. And in this episode, we'll be continuing... Hold up a sec. Yeah, I was wondering why I couldn't hear any sound while I was doing that, but um, we'll be continuing our Broken Steel Let's Play. So this is episode 2 of Broken Steel. Now, if you don't know, in the last episode, Liberty Prime got destroyed right about here, and... Um, yeah, so and now we're being told to speak with Paladin Tristan. Which I will happily go do now. It's it's been almost a year since we've done these playthroughs, and I haven't finished it simply because of things like Fortnite getting in the way. Welcome. Nice work back there. Let's hope the scribes can do something useful with the information you retrieved. Unfortunately, we don't have time to sit around and wait for the analysis. Based on what I've seen of you so far, there's an assignment I believe you're well suited for. Uh, any job you've got, I can do. I hope that's true. With all of the Brotherhood's resources committed to protecting against an enclave attack, we're spread thin. So thin that we can't spare anyone to research a new weapon that might help us against the Enclave's vertebrates. At least, until now. From information we've gathered, it seems what we need may be located in the only power works north of that city. You want me to go all the way to Elney? I need you to go there, and quickly. That's the best chance to locate a key piece of experimental equipment, called a Tesla coil. Information we've gathered suggests it's the best place to look for one, and for what the scribes are cooking up, it's absolutely essential. If you can find one, get it back here right away. We don't have much time. I have to go now. I'll be waiting for that Tesla coil, if you can find one. Ah, so I see. We're building the Tesla cannon now, aren't we? We've already been to Olney, so this should be easy for us. There is a lot of death claws here, so luckily I have over 100 stim packs. Just kill any death claws in our path, really. <sighs> no, nope, can't get in through there, so we'll just go around here then. First death class, see. Because like, they take 50 HP off you. And that's what really annoys me about this kind of stuff. So we have to go straight into, like, underneath. Like, we have to go to the sewers. And believe me, there's a lot more death claws down there than on the surface. Alright, so I think it's all the way over here we have to go. Oh, so we managed to get to the entrance without having to kill any death claws. Because I think they were too busy dealing with all these lot. <laughs> Let's just head straight in. Alright. Whoa. I'll go left.
I could use this to fix. What was the gun called? The uh, oh, I'm trying to look for it. Blackhawk. There we are. Hmm. Right. Don't know how to make weapons yet. New vehicles you can like make like recycled like plasma fuel with it. I mean like recycled micro microfusion cells. I'll just head into air first, how about that? We have Nukola missiles. Come on, do I have to drink it now do I? There's a lot of stuff I don't use in here. Oh yeah, experimental Merv. missile launcher here so I'll just take that or maybe not <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, see this is the thing I wanted to take, like, this is um, what I was mainly in here for. Now, while you're down here in Old Dunley, now this is the thing I want to teach people. You can find, by going left, prototype medic power armor. Now, what this is, is, this, this armor, it purposely annoys people wearing it, because the thing is, it ruins sneak. So when you're about to sneak up on someone, because the power armor speaks to you, like, the armor just literally speaks to you. I can't carry it right now, so I'll have to get rid of some stuff. But it is. It's quite good. There is some stuff I'll need to eat to be able to carry it. I think it'll be alright if I play some of my quantum in here. Maybe a bit of my uh, stealth boys. It's not like it's gonna get stolen or anything. I'll come back for it later. Actually, hold on. We'll need to get rid of missile launcher. Oh yeah, I can just come back for all that stuff anyways, Kai. You know, I'll just go straight to the end. It's down here. Duck and cover. Power armor manual. Watch it. I'll, I'll wear the power armor and show you. Shut up, you goddamn puke. You are now wearing prototype medic power armor. You take care of me, and I'll take care of you. See, that is what happens when you start to wear the power armor. It ruins sneak. Apparently, this is 
this is quite an annoying parameter to use, but for now I'm just going to use my T51B because, you know, why not? But I always love to carry this parameter on me because it's unique and you won't be able to get it again once you lose it, so I'll keep heading this way. There's tension. <laughs> Normally, I die quite a lot down in these sewers, but this seems to be my lucky day. What's in here? Average. All right. Those are quite rare, but I'm not going to take it. In fact, I don't think it'll even despawn. take purified water but the thing is the only thing I can do is increase my karma using it and it's not what I want to do the one thing I've always failed to do is a bad karma playthrough in Fallout no I always seem to be like the good guy I always think I'm gonna do it so Keep heading this way. And up here. What the? How the hell did you get in here, smooth skin? I'm looking for all only power works, you know where that is? Oh yeah, yeah, sure thing. Uh, just right through here. Only there's a few death claws down here that might have other ideas. You know what I'm saying? I'm not afraid of death claws. Yeah? Well then you're stupid. Where do you think they're all coming from, huh? Goddamn nest down here. Take it from me, kid. You stay down here, you're gonna die. But hey, it's your funeral, right? Me and kid, we're getting out of here. Figure the way you came's got to be pretty clear if you're still alive. All right. There's a lot of food I'd want to take, but I just can't. This is the problem. I'll head straight on through there. Hold on. Oh. No. The med kit server. Here. Whoa. I should take 
got some stim packs. Could do for some. God, uh, I'm really thinking what else is it to take from here. Things like buff out, sorry to take because they don't have anywhere. Neither does like bullets, which I've always found to be awkward, but I found it to be useful. Keep going down here. Be a few fragments down here. No, I might use Lincoln's repeater. I haven't used that in a long time. I've been playing this game for years and I still keep forgetting about the fragments.
So desperate to take the quantum. I just can't. Did that without using that, so that seemed like an alright kill for me. Oh, got some microfusion cells in down here. Whoa. I definitely know that's Young Cliff. Probably don't have time to take everything in here, so I'm just gonna leg it. After I've tried to loot everywhere. There's a wall safe here. I think it's one of the um, new weapons, heavy incinerator. <sighs> I'm thinking 
the bandmaster. Nah, not the bandmaster. That's not good enough. Uh, yeah, I can't take that incinerator, so I'll have to come back for one. There we are. All only power works. Yeah. Let's probably get our Tesla coil. I'm not good at these terminals, but... I always like to try. Oh. Good guess. Uh, <laughs> no, not really. I just, like, keep turning it off. Yeah. Uh, is there anything I could have? Could have that. Yeah. Uh. Head straight on for rear car. is heavily radiated so I will just like it well we'll have to take some right away. Right, fishing battery. I don't need to use that. This is where we get the Tesla car coil. I feel like I'm gonna die if I do this, but I have to jump in down there. And I survived. It's alright, a cool little easter egg. You can find some alien power cells down here that you can use for the um, alien blaster if you do get it. 
or the fire lance because I can't really get the fire lance so I'm not sure it'll be guide to show you guys but anyway that's just a little tip for you Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I got a Tesla coil now. So there isn't really any work I have to do. Now I'm just gonna go back to Paladin Tristan for this convenient emergency exit. Alright, I'll have to go back to Paladin Tristan now. So, there are a lot of dead raiders outside who have been stripped. But, uh, yeah. Gonna go meet him. Found a Tesla coil? Excellent. I'll see to it that this reaches the scribes immediately. You've done good work, soldier. Are you ready for your next assignment? We don't have time to spare. I'm good to go. What's next? Based on the data you brought us from the relay station, we've identified where the Enclave is basing their operation. It seems they have a second base of operations at Adams Air Force Base outside of DC. The only safe way to get there is through the presidential metro used by the government before the war. You're going to be on your own again for now. The rest of the Brotherhood will be providing a distraction so you can slip in undetected. Once you breach the presidential metro and get to Adams Air Force Base, look for the resupply crate. Inside, you'll find your new orders, and hopefully we can put a working Tesla cannon into your hands. Alright, so we have just completed quest shock value and I've leveled up as well. So the pack I'm gonna get is Probably should I go for I love computer wiz, why not? But uh yeah, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Fallout Free Broken Steel. Now in the next episode We'll be going to Adam's Air Force Base, of course. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and check out my Twitter below. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.